momentum. Hi guys and welcome to our physics series and today we have a question too. Figure 2.1 shows a dummy of mass 70 kg used in a crash test to investigate the safety of a new car. The car approaches a solid barrier at 20 meters per second. It crashes into the barrier and it stops suddenly. For A, for AI, calculate the momentum of the dummy immediately before the crash. For calculated momentum, symbol by the letter P equals mass times the velocity. So the mass is 70 kg times the velocity, which is 20 meter per second, equals 1,400 kg meter per second. For question 2 AI, the examiner report said the majority of candidates had learned momentum equals mass times the velocity and used uh, successfully. So you calculate the numerical value, some multiplied or divided the correct value by G. There was less certainty over the unit with kilogram slash meter slash second, sometimes seen along with other examples. In double I, determine the impulse that must be applied to the dummy to bring it to rest. We highlight three keywords. Determine, impulse, and rest. Impulse equals change in momentum. Final momentum minus initial momentum. The final momentum is zero because the dummy and the car become at rest. An initial momentum is 1,400 from the previous point I. The impulse is 1,400 kilogram meter per second or 1,400 newton second. For B, in the crash test, the passenger compartment comes to rest in 0.20 seconds. Calculate the deceleration of the passenger compartment. We highlight keywords rest and 0.20 seconds as a time taken and to calculate and the third finally deceleration. Deceleration equals change in velocity or speed divided by the time taken. Final velocity is 0, initial velocity is 20 and the time taken 0.20. So 0 minus 20 divided by 0.20. C. The seat belt and airbag bring the dummy to rest so that it doesn't hit the window screen. The dummy has an average deceleration of 80 meter per second square. Calculate the average resultant force applied to the dummy of the mass 70 kg. We are going to highlight some keywords seat belt, airbag, and dummy to rest, which is final velocity is zero, and deceleration 80 meter per second square, and average uh, resultant force. Symbol of deceleration is A, and the symbol of force is F. According to Newton's second law of motion, F equal M A, and the mass is 70 kilogram, and deceleration is 80, so uh, force is. Uh, 5,600 Newton. For part D, the deceleration of the dummy is less than the deceleration of the passenger compartment. Explain why this is uh, of, the, of benefit for the safety of passenger. Deceleration of dummy is 80 meter per second square and deceleration of the passenger compartment is 100 meter per second square. The impact force on passenger or dummy becomes less according to Newton's second law of motion. Dummy is less likely to be damaged or passenger is less likely to be injured. The end of the video, please don't forget to share and like and subscribe. Thank you.